Hi everybody, it's me. I'm here to do a kind of an update. I painted my bathroom. I yes, I do rent, but there was we had a problem with mo I had a problem with mold, so my mom and I had to go get like mold killing primer, and so we painted the whole house with my whole bathroom with it, and then I just. We painted it. Yes, I probably have to repaint it when I move out. But, you know, paint can be pretty cheap if you, you know, you know, just paint over white and with the cheapest paint you could find. And I guess you can go. But, um, yeah. So I'm going to get started. I went with a purple theme because purple is my favorite color. Um, I got the shower cut a long time ago. Um, I got that at Walmart. Then I got the rug that's dirty and needs to be washed. Um, then I got some purple towels. And this is what it just looks like. Just purple all over. There's, a two, there's two shades of purple. Um, so yeah. I just got done making these little flower pictures. Um, these are like paper flowers. I just stuck it in a picture frame. And I put it up. I painted that silver. Um, and the trim is white. And I got new of these thingies. Then I painted that as well. Um, silver. Then I got this. I have like and that stuff in my basket. Uh, the stuff I use. And then I got all of this but the bamboo at Walmart. The abandoned boot is real. I got that at Lowe's. Um, the paint I got at Lowe's and Menards. Um, so yeah. And the, the towels and the dirty rug. I get so dirty so easily. I got at Walmart. The shower curtains from Walmart. Um, so I also painted the um, window. And the window was our biggest problem because there's a window in the shower. I mean, it gets wet and it's wood and it just, yeah, it was awful. So yeah, the window in the shower is the worst. And there was this mold all over the ceiling. I still need to touch up on some of the paint on the ceiling. But yeah, I really like it. I like the outcome. I was going to go with butterflies, but I just did flowers. It's kind of like a farm country theme going on. Um, and this was a people with a whole bunch of makeup and stuff. I don't wear makeup often, so I just decorated up here. I put makeup, the makeup and stuff elsewhere. And then, like I said, the main stuff I use mainly, then like Kleenexes and Phenomen Phenomen Hygiene products. Um, I put hair ties in my clothes, PJs. Then I have my toilet paper thing and my toilet thingy. So yeah, I really like it. I like my shower curtain. I like my mirror. I just really like it. I um, just wanted to do a quick um, little update. I love the shower curtain. Like I said, that rug gets so freaking dirty. It, it's disgusting. But um, yeah, I'm not going to open the shower curtain because it's... That still needs work. That still needs work. And I kind of like some of this is the landlord is doing. So, you know, like the shower is in a um, bathtub faucet. It's messed up. It's the landlord is doing. They should have fixed it when I first moved in, but they didn't want to. Blah, blah, blah. The sink's been clogged forever. And that's, I can fix that, my my doing, but yeah, I'm not going to open the shower curtain because the shower tire is dirty still and there are two tires missing. But yeah, I'm really happy with the painting. I'm happy the mold is gone. I'm happy it's just a nice looking bathroom and I do want to, um, like I do want to, um, hold on. I do want to paint the rest of my house, but I like I said, I do rent and I don't want to spend all that money if I'm going to move out soon after I um, paint. My bedroom is going to be like, I want my bedroom to be like a cream, creamy orange because I have a bedspread that's orange. 
Then the kitchen, I'm gonna do the brightest white, cleanest, crisp white as possible, and it's gonna be something. It's gonna be like this a lot of flamingo stuff in my kitchen because I'm going for flamingo, my flamingo themed in my kitchen due to that I bought a spoon rest when I was in the Bahamas, and after that, I decided that I wanted to do everything with the flamingos. Then my um, living room is gonna be like a natural, neutral color, and then the spare room. I have an idea what to do with that. Like, if it stays my pet room, I want to do it like white and black and like a whole bunch of pet, dog and cat like themes. But it was going to be like a nursery one day when I have kids, if I have kids, or if I ever have kids. It's going to be whatever color the child is, you know, pink or blue. And it was like themed. Then I probably should paint my laundry room, but it's in like this ugly bright green. But what I want to do is I want to turn, like if I have children, I want to turn the pet room into the nursery, take everything out, clean it to top to bottom, wax the floors, you know, just it needs to work really bad because my cat's been in there for four years now, five years. And then I want to move them to the, okay, the cats, everything of the cats, the Freddy's cage, into the mud laundry room. And I have a corner where I can put like a cat tree and the little boxes and probably Freddy's cage and have just that stuff out there. And then my garage is going to be my storage unit because my garage is actually really small and there's really no chance of parking a car in there and I don't even have one. So, you know, garage is going to be a bit of my storage unit. Like, you know. So yeah, and uh, if you don't, I got this. I got this at Hobby Lobby. All this stuff to make at Hobby Lobby. So yeah, I really liked how this turned out. I'm happy with it. I can't wait to paint more of this house. You know, it painting this bathroom made it feel like it's my bathroom, not you know the windows, landlord's bathroom. So I'm really happy about that. Uh, like I said, I wanted to paint my kitchen like a green color to go up the flamingos, but then I, I can't, I haven't found a green I liked, and I don't want it to be too much. I kind of want my kitchen to be bright, you know, because I like bright things. I like, so yeah. So yeah, creamsicle orange for my bedroom. Um, the spell bedroom is still iffy because, you know, I don't know what I'm going to do with that room quite yet. Um, the kitchen and the living room is going to be like, you know, a neutral calm. I think I want to go with comma, like a comma kind of. Um, yeah. So I'm going to take this girl. I'm going to show you my babies. There's one baby. Kitty, 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 kitty. No? Okay. So like I said, the cat tree, the dog cage, and the little boxes, and the cat toys are all going to go into the, um, the laundry room. And some of these toys probably come out here. That dresser and everything will go out into the garage. Like I said, if I keep this my pet room, it's gonna be like a black and gray and white theme. And yeah, there's my there's my Bobby. There's my Bobby. Yeah, here's my Bobs. I don't know what Maggie says it will do. She. Are you in here? No? Okay. Are you in here? No. Oh, I don't know where my is at. I'm not going to show you the bedroom because it's not made. So hi, Freddy. And I've been good. I have other updates I'm going to do later on. Oh, there's Maggie. Maggie! So how I show you what I mean by flamingos. I got flamingo light stretches. Okay, my kitchen might be a little messy. I do have a hanging there, but I took it off for like... Easter and I never put it back. I took it off so I could put Easter stuff there, but I never put it back. I got two of these, like the walls need to be painted badly. Oh, and then I put my coffee maker there. I had it over here, but I took it away for a little bit and then I brought it back and I have that thing that my mom got me. Hold on. It lights up. And I brought my coffee maker over here. And then I have you know, just flamingo stuff, like, everywhere. I've just got that, um, cookie holder. It has, um, cookie jar. It has my onions in it. 
I got those, I got that. I got this flamingo stuff. I got that. I got that. Yeah, I just got a lot of flamingo stuff. What, Maggie? Why are you on the kitchen counter? But yeah, I have other kitchen towels that are flamingo. And this is what I got at the Bahamas when I was in the Bahamas um, last January. Um, so that was started the whole flamingo thing a lot. I said I like wanted to paint like a, the kitchen like a green, but I'm not for sure. And I think like a really pretty white would be good. The kitchen needs a lot of work. So yeah, that's what I want to do. And like I said, the living room, I kind of want to do like a caramel color just because that's what I want. I think I'm good, good with my furniture. Who are friends? Good with my, good with my furniture and blah, blah, blah. But um, here, I'll show you my unmade bed. These doors are so hard to open. Yeah, this is my, gosh, you know, when you get up, like this is the little blanket I bought. Well, I didn't get by this, but um, this is my Nana's and I was going to this after she passed away. Um, yes, Freddie. So yeah, really pretty. And this is, I just want to do like a cream sickle orange. I can sure I had to change her those curtains and stuff like that. So yeah, my bed's not made, but who cares if my bed's not made? I'm really not trying to impress too many people, you know. What, what, what Maggie? All right, well, I'm going to let you guys go, and I hope you have a good Memorial Day tomorrow, and thank you to everybody who has served. Um, thank you, and you guys have a great day, and thank you for watching my video, and have a great day tomorrow, and like I said, thank you everybody who has served our country. Bye. And thank you. What? What do you say? You say bye? I'm going to say thank you. Do you want to say thank you? Woof. No? Say thank you? Maggie? Kitty, 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 kitty? No? Okay, goodbye. All right, bye.